good everybody and welcome back to the Mains by Mel YouTube channel. I am your main girl Mel and we have a very special guest as part of the channel today. Welcome back Tiffany. Hello Tiffany, it's wonderful to have you back. Thanks for having me. You may remember her from our wavy hair styling tutorial where me and my sister styled her and her sister and we showed them that they actually have wavy hair they just didn't know how to style it. Now you guys love that video and since then you have been asking for a haircut tutorial which we already shared on your sister. And today with Tiffany, we're gonna be sharing with you guys an overnight nighttime routine and also a very easy morning refresh to maintain the waves. Shake it, shake it, shake what your mama gave you. <laughs> this tutorial is gonna be really quick, really easy and it's gonna save you a lot of time in the morning. So get your scarf ready. And without further ado, let's get to it! If you've been watching this channel for a while, if you know me, you know I sleep with my beloved bonnet every single night. I really can't sleep without it. It is the way that I preserve my curls overnight. But since a bonnet is a fixed size, it doesn't work for wavier hair that would just be floating all over the place and may get a little messy and lose its shape overnight. Now with the scarf, okay, get this. The idea with the scarf style for you to sleep overnight is exactly how we plop your hair. What? What are you talking about? Ah. This is new. Yes. If you don't know what a plop is, yes, it's a very unfortunate name for a <laughs> technique that involves towel drying your hair all scrunched up. Now, if you watched the wavy hair styling tutorial, you already saw how we styled your hair in a plop. The reason why it works is because you're already drying your hair in that scrunched up shape. So it really helps to enhance the curls for more bounce so they don't fall so quickly. Which is exactly what you want to also do overnight, but not, not wet. Let's try not to leave your hair wet overnight, but we're going to show you exactly how to tie your headscarf. And I'm going to give this one over to you. You can follow along. This is very simple. This is exactly how we're going to do it. We're just going to zoom out quick. Perfect right there and hold it. We look good? We, we look, look good. Great. So you can see we have a table in front of us. You will need a flat surface, but before we go ahead and plop, you know, take a look at yourself. You look good now, but it's likely not going to get any better. It will probably get worse. So anything where we don't like, if there's any curls that are already sitting a little bit too loose for you, do the work now so in the morning you don't have to. And what we're going to do to set those curls is by doing pin curls. Pin curls are so easy to do. All you need is your fingers and a pin. For example, this curl's taken a bit of a beating over the day. You've been tucking it behind your ear, you've been playing with it. So the pieces around her face have loosened a little bit. If we want them to be a little perky curl, you wanna set it overnight. Usually you can either work with the curl, her curl is curling towards her face, but many people like their pieces around their face to curl away. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna take this section and I'm gonna use my fingers like they're a curling wand and just wrap the piece of hair around my fingers, pinch it and pin it. Just like that, you have a little pin curl. You can do this to as many curls as you want. We're gonna do it to a couple more, this section right here. But of course, this is completely optional. You don't have to do this. It will make those curls really springy because overnight, if they stay like this, they're gonna stay like this in the morning and you will see when we come back in a few hours after she goes sleeping. <laughs> and now we're gonna set the rest of the hair in another way, in the plop. Now, Tiff, please hold. And please follow along. If you have a scarf, this is a large satin head scarf. Where did you get this one? Amazon. She got this one on Amazon. Very cute. This is very, I mean, it's it, a flower. Can I borrow this from you? Oh yeah, it kind of matches. Goes, it kind of goes with my outfit. Anywho, <clears throat> moving on. This is a large square headscarf, handkerchief, neckerchief, whatever you want to call it. The material is satin and the shiny side is currently facing Tiff's body. Now you want to turn the scarf to a diamond and start rolling and folding that top corner until almost halfway through. Now lay it over the table and flip your hair forward. If you have short hair like Tiff does, you probably don't want this all sticking up. It'll be very difficult to get it back down in the morning. So any of the hairs at the back of your head and at your nape, let them just lay flat. They may get flat, but it's fine because it's underneath everything else. All the rest of the hair is flipped upside down, which is gonna help give volume. And it is scrunched up in the scarf, just like a towel, just like a plop. And you're gonna take the edge of the scarf where you had rolled it 
and that's going to help to secure it. The roll helps to get a firm grip on the hair and you're going to place it at the back of your neck and now pinch the sides of the scarf. Now with that other corner of the scarf, just add it to one hand and now you have the whole scarf gathered in two of your hands. You're going to simply tie a knot at the top of your head and then you can twist and tuck in the tails. Now not only is this going to be protective, but you actually look pretty cute going to bed. I'm not going to lie. I like it. Yes, you do have some little short hair flares going on here. It's a little bit of a party in the back. <laughs> what you can also do is pin curl these if you want. Tip, your hair is too short for that, so there's yeah. really no point. But if your hair is too long and you feel like you can see that, you may pin curl these as well. This is very secure. Can we, can we get a little head shake going on? Yeah, it's not going anywhere. The hair is not moving because there's not a lot of space in there. It's all tied very tight. Also, this is snug around your head, so you can sleep like an animal and she's not going nowhere. I'm very excited to see how you look in the morning. It's all going to stay very tight and we will show you guys what that looks like. But I will mention that if you feel like this is doing too much now and you would rather do more work in the morning, you can just be very simple with it and just put your hair up in a high and very loose ponytail or as we call it a pineapple or in Tiff's case if you have short hair you would want to do just a half up half down ponytail and leave out leave out the little hairs <laughs> for another day worry about those later we do love to use these slinky scrunchy invisible fangs of course a satin or silk scrunchie works as well but if you ask me this is the best way to go and we call this the slungy slunch slunch it it's, it's like sleeping and scrunching at the same okay. time. Yeah, I like slunch. it. Slunch. Hashtag slunch it. What's the hashtag? Hashtag slunch it. You look great, Tiff. And we'll see you all in the morning with her very minimal but very efficient refresh. Good morning, Good morning everybody. <laughs> we are here with the big reveal. And I thought I'd come on with my bonnet too to show you guys the difference between a wavy hair refresh and then you'll just see what my hair looks like. So, uh, Tiff, let's take it away. Let's, do let's it. take it all off. Good morning. Yeah. Wow, it really oh. held up beautifully. It did. How do you look? You look beautiful. Well, wow. I mean, first, shake and bake. But shake it, shake it up. Shake it off. Is that what oh, Katy Perry says? To be. <laughs> so this is great. This is a great starting point. We've got her little pin curls around her face. And can you just do a little spin a room? It looks great. It still stayed intact. And when I said they would be boingy, well, I wasn't boingy. kidding. They really set overnight. If you really want to, go nuts. Do your whole head like this. Do whatever curls on top if you want. But of course, we love to frame the face. And that is just framing it. She looks great. The silk scarf really helped to protect her hair overnight. But if you did want to refresh the hair a little bit, sometimes what can happen is the hair can separate. You can get some crimps and things in the roots. So if you want to fluff that out and get a little extra volume in your root area, is apply dry shampoo. This is one of my favorites. It's from Weedad. It smells delicious. It's completely invisible. And it's actually a moisturizing dry shampoo. It's not very drying but it does help to suck up the oils, and most importantly, it's a great way to add volume in the morning. So if you wanna just, just give it a little, a little flipperoo, shake it up, shake it up. And we wanna focus in the crown, so we can get some nice lift in there. Let it sit for a moment before you massage it in. Okay. So you can simply massage with your fingers, and you just wanna fluff and lift and immediately that's helping to separate the hair, anything that's starting to clump from the natural hair oils and anything that just got stiff overnight. Now from here, if you find that too many of your curls have really lost their shape, add a little bit more of whatever gel you use to style. We had used this Bounce Curl Light Cream Gel. So I'm gonna use a little bit of this mixed with some water to glaze over some pieces of hair. This is just gonna, again, add some hold back to the hair. I do encourage you avoid spraying all over the hair. It can cause more frizz as opposed to spraying it in your hand with the product, you can control it more. Or another option for a dry refresh that is really quick, you don't have to add any water. This spray from Aussie is one of my favorites. It gives hold and grit and texture to the hair and it really helps to set that style. It's the Aussie Miracle Curls Curl Refresher. It's super affordable, smells delicious, and it works. Spray and scrunch to help set 
You don't want to wet the hair too much because this is going to kind of reset the curls. It may weigh them down too much and straighten them out. So you really don't want to be wetting the hair down. It really does give a little bit of extra grit and texture and hold to the hair. And we could have sprayed this in your hair overnight. We actually sprayed it in her hair when it was freshly styled to just kind of set that all in place. And the last thing is if you do find that you're a little flat in the crown or any areas near your roots and you want to add some extra volume, but using a pick doesn't work because using a pick would just be brushing out the root and making it even straighter, you will find that if you use a comb like so and tease the hair, so you're back combing, bringing it back, brushing the hair towards the scalp rather than picking it out, you will achieve much more volume in wavier hair. If you have short hair, you don't really have to worry about the underneath. Unless it does show, you may just have to refresh that area in the morning. Or like I said, pin curl at night. And that's about it. Now, how hard is this going to be for you to do, Tiff? It's not hard. It's just definitely a change because I never really used to like do this routine. But it's definitely worth it because I've never got my hair to look like this before. And I definitely want it to keep looking like this. So I'll keep on doing it to keep up with it. The best part is this is pretty much damage free. You're protecting your hair overnight, so it's not getting damaged by your pillowcase, by hair ties, or anything like that. And we didn't use any excessive heat or heat tools to achieve this style, besides a diffuser, but that's fine. Again, if you want to see how we did achieve this style and how we would style her wavy hair, we have an old video on that, so make sure you check out the wavy hair tutorial. We'll link it in the description box below. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Give us a thumbs up, would you? Tiffany, thank you so much for coming on. Thank you for having me. I love you. You look love so you cute. I hope you guys found this tutorial helpful. You can also find any tools and products that we used in the description box below. And we hope that you stick around for more videos just like this one. If you do, we'll see you next week. Peace! Peace. Look around. There's a bit of bed head there. She like literally woke up like this. Welcome to the slumcher party. It's really like ethereal. It's very royal. You look fab. Very 40s. <laughs> Do, 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 do. Ready and begin. Have you ever seen the videos of people putting on leggings and they, they just cut a hole, cut a hole yeah. there? It's crafty. <laughs> Quiet, that's it. Let's just zoom out. Perfect. None of that was terrible. You have no idea what you're doing. Tiffany, we're ready for you. Please, please make your way back on set, please. Let's first just zoom out a little bit. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> this is a bad idea. I look up to you. You got it. Now, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze the whole fucking thing. Oh my god, oh you're, my god, so, you're good. so good. You are so good. <laughs> you are so Tiff. She's such a pro. You're she makes funny. it look so easy. Her hair is coming out. Her hair is coming out. No, don't say that. Stick it in. Stick it in, Tiff. Stick it in. You make it look so Oh funny. my god. Oh my god, I'm so proud of you. Slunch. Hashtag slunch. Slunch. It. Slunch, slunch it. it. Oh, but you got it. You got it. You're so close. Sunch it? Sunch it. Sunch it. Oh, where is it? You were so close. Oh, you you were doing well. Nice. Ah, you were doing well. It may take some getting used to. <laughs> is it great, sweetie? Slunch. Hashtag slunch. Slunch. Slunch, slunch it. it. Good morning. You guys look so beautiful. Slunch it. Slunch it. It's like slunch. sleep Hashtag and scrunch. Slunch it. Oh, hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it. That's a wrap. We'll Bye see night. you in the morning. Good night. See you in the morning.